We cannot say this enough. If you see something, say something. If you see a threat on social media, do not repost it, report it to law enforcement. These aren't just words to overlook. Your action could save lives, and that rang true this week at Northeast Guilford High School. Authorities say a tip from a student led to the school resource officer finding a stolen gun. Now two teenagers face charges. WFNY News News Jenna Kurzina is live at the school with more on what happened. Lauren and Julie, there's a sign on this campus that many of us have seen before. It says this is a weapon free. This is a gun free school zone. And because two Northeast high school students decided not to follow that rule, they are now facing charges. As you mentioned, there was a tip from a student that led law enforcement to the gun. Guilford County Sheriff Danny Rogers didn't want to go on camera, but did answer our questions about the situation. This all happened on Monday afternoon when school dismissed around 415. Investigators say the gun was stolen from Catawba County, which is about an hour and a half southwest of Greensboro. Both students face charges because the investigation determined both were in possession of the gun on school grounds. The sheriff's office says a school resource officer and administrators were told about the possibility of a gun on campus. That's when they were led to the car where the teens were, and then the gun was found in the parking lot. And because this seems to be an ongoing trend, I reached out to all of the Guilford County School Board members at this time. Only one got back to me, Pat Tillman, and he says, I asked him if there had been any additional uh, discussions about safety measures. He said right now safety is a top priority for the school district, um, but right now that is all that we have heard.